Good morning. <clears throat> Rain at last. I've been here for pretty much a month, I think. <laughs> it's the first time it's rained. <laughs> right, on love. Two commandments. Love God, love your neighbour as yourself. Now, everyone, anyone can understand what love is. Amen. Noise is off. <laughs> the wind's getting up. Maybe the window upstairs, I think. We all need love. I mean, it's sort of fundamental to human life, for heaven's sake. We need food and water, obviously, and shelter out of the rain, which is what it is, so hence why I've got the fire on. Lucky me. Indeed. But then we need love. Well, actually, in the first instance, we need love. <clears throat> that is what sustains life. Makes it what it is. Love. L-O-V-E. I'm growing older. And it's so simple. If we have love in our hearts... One cannot do bad things. One cannot even think bad thoughts. Love. I've met this woman across the way. She's 39 years old. Two almost grown up children. I think 17 and 19 or something, and a grandchild's come along. And she's got a very troubled past, which I'll not mention further. And present, quite frankly. The father, anyway, she's the Roman Catholic, and she left the father of her children and stuff. I mean, I, yeah, I don't know. She latched on to I mean, that's why I bought the motor car for what it's worth, to try and help her or something. I don't know. I bought a little motor car for her, all right. <laughs> Silly me. But anyway, that's all, you know, inevitably as inevitably it's fizzled out. I've still got the motor car. <laughs> it's a lovely little blue, dark blue, panda, a Fiat panda. And she's called Mademoiselle Eleanor. And she works quite new tyres. 67,000 miles on the clock. Didn't cost her plenty. So she's sitting outside. So... I don't need a car. Not really. Anyway, there we are. Love. Love is the answer to anything and everything. Doesn't matter what's going on. Retreat within yourself and shine whatever's going on into the mirror of God.
God's presence and so on, love. That's the answer.